Welcome back. Great to have you here at mid-morning on WKYT. It's a common complaint this time of year. Hot summer days can cause frizzy, sun-damaged hair. You said you know all about it. Oh, huh? absolutely. <laughs> Can't you tell? Huh? Well, Lydia Nemeth, the owner of Atea Salon, is here to share with us some advice to help reduce the damage. We're glad to have you here. Boy, very timely, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. And thank you so much for having me. So um, Amber asked me to come here and talk about some of the many problems that women especially face during the summer time due to environmental factors like humidity like we're dealing with today. So with frizz, you have a couple different options, um, two specifically. <laughs> Deal with it, no. Yes. <laughs> Uh, deal with it is one yeah, of them. One Go of. with the flow four. And, and so how do you, how can you actually tame it? The best do do? way that I usually recommend is for people to get a keratin treatment. It's called mm -hmm. a keratin smoothing treatment. And you can actually get that at typically any salon that you already go to. I actually had Amber Canoy come in last week and try it and we have a before and after, after over there of her. Um, oh wow. Yeah, yeah, she mm -hmm. loved it. So, um, and what you would do is you come in, get the keratin treatment and it helps reduce the frizz and repair your hair from the inside to the outside. And it reduces frizz by up to 98%, reduces dry time by 50% and helps add shine. Boy, that's huge. Yeah, it's Those a numbers. great option. So, and if somebody, if that's too intensive for people, then your stylist can recommend and other routines such as just a deep conditioning treatment or like a really great shampoo, conditioner, and at-home smoothing Kinds treatment. Kinds of things you can do at home, right? Absolutely, yeah. If you want to be a little bit more economical or just not spend as much time in it. All right, so even guys notice, you know, with the sunlight, you, your hair sort of starts lightening up in the summer, and that's mm -hmm. fine with, uh, with many people, but some may uh, want to deal with that, right? Yes, yeah. absolutely. So that's another problem that people tend to face in the summer is color fading, and it tends to bring out a lot of brassiness, which, you know, most women hate that word. So there are more options you can do. Um, some pretty simple fixes I always like to recommend are one, wearing a hat every time you go out in the sun for prolonged periods of time, because the sun can fade your hair more than any other factor. Um, in addition, I always recommend getting your hair wet before going into any pool or the ocean or the lake, and that helps protect your hair. And then afterwards, shampoo with a really great, great clarifying shampoo and a good conditioner to seal those ends back. Down. All right, some good advice there. Mm -hmm. Also for eyelashes, what can you yes. do? Oh gosh, I love eyelash <laughs> extensions. Um, so you have two options. You can either get an eyelash extension treatment, which um, you apply one fake lash to one real lash and it creates a very natural or glamorous effect that needs to be done in the salon. And the second option is a lift and tint. And mm -hmm. that's for women that have naturally great lashes and um, just usually have to do a curler and then put mascara on. We do that in the salon for you, only it's permanent. So we permanently curl your lashes then tint it so it looks like you curled them at home and put mascara on. And they can get wet and it's not ruined and it's great. Lots you can do then. Yes. All right. Good wanna, options. If people want to come by and see you, you are? We're downtown at 301 East Vine Street. Okay. Thanks yeah. for coming Thank by. Thank you so much. Always good to Appreciate see you. It.